It's considered a leaflet, but the whole thing. Hello, my name is Haywood Morgan, and I'm the urban forester with the city of Denton. Today, we're going to be doing a little bit of tree ID here in Quaker Town Park. Okay, today we're going to start off with the pecan, which is actually the state tree for the state of Texas. So when you're looking at the pecan tree, one thing that you notice that is have what we call a compound leaf. Each one of these is considered a leaflet, but the whole thing is actually considered a leaf. So a pecan tree, as the name suggests, produces pecans, which is an edible nut. Generally, the tree is a large size tree, which will get you know anywhere from 50 to 60 feet in height and live over 100, 150 years old. Okay, next we're gonna look at white oak and red oak, which are two uh, varieties of oaks within the oak family. On the right here, we have a white oak, which is actually a bur oak. And on the left here, we have a red oak, which is a Schumard oak. So on the white oak, the lobes here, they're gonna be more rounded at the tips. And on the red oak, they're gonna be pointed, almost come to a needle type point. By looking at those two differences, you can tell the difference between the red oak and the white oak. So here we have our red bud, and as you notice, the leaves are heart-shaped, which is characteristic of the red bud tree. It's known as an understory tree, which means that it can survive in uh, low sunlight. Thank you for tuning in with us today as we identify some of the trees here in Quaker Town Park. Texas Arbor Day is celebrated on November 6th and part of celebrating Arbor Day is planting trees. So if you have space in your yard and would like to plant a tree in celebration of Texas Arbor Day, please plant a tree this year. If you have any further questions about any of your trees or any advice on what types of trees to plant, please feel free to contact me, Haywood Morgan, at the email address below.